Hey there guys, gals, fans, and pals, your buddy John Megacycle here. Another episode of Seven Days to Die coming at you. I think they're trying a different entrance. I want them to keep coming over here. I do not want them to go anywhere else. I wouldn't mind a little fun myself as well. I know this is risky, but none of that crap helps me right now, and I can do something like this. Rise and shine, dead man. Rise and shine. Okay, so now I have all the stuff. I can sort all that crap later, but right now it keeps my inventory lean and the floor lean. Which is what I want. Can I repair that by chance? I can't. Can I do... Oh, I've got frames on me. Uh-huh. What you want? I don't need this steel right there. Oops. This whole lip right here is saving my butt. Oh crap, they're coming from another direction. Okay. Well, this is good because I'm not behind my turrets. I can be protected by them as the enemies run past, right? Just like that. So same formation, same everything. Oh, you ran out of ammo. Oh, that was dangerous. Just like that. Crap, 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 crap. There is so much rotted meat on the floor here, it's ridiculous. Yup. What you got, mate? You got a whole lot of hole in your face. Okay, so that's a problem. Because that. Crap. Cool. Buys me a little bit of time to reload, rearm, replace. Oh, craps. Oh my god, I have two more hours of this. I thought we were at the tail end. Nope.
No, my turrets! Where the hell? Oh, come on, that's not even funny. Oh wait, they're actually shooting still? That's stupid. That's really, really stupid. Well, now I have to do something like this. Through literally no fault of my own. Yeah, that that platform, that whole plan was defensible up until this point. Yeah, now there's nothing I can do. That was dumb! Modify, take that out, thanks. Let's scrap that, let's eat. Man, that was going really, really well, too. Whatever. Uh, I could auger my way down there, but I don't have enough time for that crap. Uh, yeah, I don't have enough time for that. They're just... they're just... yep. I had a really good defensive position and everything with that, I feel. That, uh, funneling the enemies down is really great on a lot of high-end structures like office buildings where the hit points of each block is like 10,000 or what else? There's some buildings like they just reinforced glass all the way or something and it's really great because you have a lot of extra hit points that the enemy has to just trudge in their way through. Eggs? Cool. You know what? Might as well have a little beer. Yep. Nice buzz. You're feeling rowdy. Oh, that's good. Let's have a bit of an eat. Or at least a little bit of a drink. I'm still full from all the food I ate from the from the drops. Now imagine those drops, but 20 more percent, yeah? Pretty crazy, right? I feel really cheap doing this. Uh, shotguns can pierce through light things or whatever. I don't know how the logic in that works, but... They get another helmet. Man. At one time, I wished I had a lot of these. Now I have all of these. Uh, three o'clock. Yep. Turrets are still active. Oh, crap. Well, I can still participate, I guess. Nope. 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 <laughs> nope on a nope rope. Uh, if I decide I want to stick with shotguns as my primary weapon, I might put in some ranks to get me better shotgun skill. I forgot where the thing is, but it's better piercing, better murder. All the better murder. Now imagine like the Swedish chef, chef saying it right. He is pretty good Birdie birdie! Chicken in the basket! Make your move, dead man. I'm just gonna repair that real quick. And reload this real quick. 
I'm sure that loot room is absolutely devastated. Emotionally and physically. But as long as I can get my turrets back, that's fine. And that, that of all things probably bugs me the most. Hey, have something that you're just going to place real quick and pick up often, and there's a really high chance that uh, you'll die if you don't have this item deployed properly? Yep. Let's just phase that through the floor for you. Free of charge. You guys kind of figured it out, huh? Well, it took you like an hour. Good chat, dead man. Okay. Oh, hey. Weapons bag. Thanks. I didn't know that was there. What the hell? Oh crap, item needs repairs. That's what I'm talking about. Thank goodness repairs are t pretty quick. Oh, more stuff. Alright, let's breach and clear the rest of the place and I need my turrets back. That worked out flawlessly. Aside from the turret drop, that worked out beautifully. I loved it. Oh, I guess I could have done that. I heard a zombie. Whoa. Whew. Yeah, th this is, this is dumb. I'm just gonna sell that crap. Uh, I might as well eat and drink. Get some of these items out of my inventory because I have tons of items, or I'm soon too. Alright, where's my auger? Oh my god, 5,000? You remember when I said, oh, hey, I could probably just uh, auger my way through? Nope. Nope. Absolutely nope. Ah. Oh, thank God. I was like, if there's... If it's stone all the way down, I'm gonna be so mad. Yep. Because that makes a whole lot of sense as to what happened. Nope. Reload. You boys did good work. You saved my bacon. You saved my bacon. Alright, now let's just silo our butts out of here. Ah, come on. Okay, I'll just take the plant fibers. I don't care. There. And there you go. Whew. Well, we survived. Again, pretty happy about that. It is good to be online. How well, may I assist you? I'm happy to hear that. Uh, we have a lot of stuff to haul. Oh, I'd like to repair that, please. Some 
of this stuff I will be keeping for sure. Don't need the baseball bat. Don't need the hunting knife. We got a lot of shotgun ammo out of that. Holy crap. And a lot of 762. Wow. 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 Yeah, we got a lot of stuff. Is everything reloaded? No, just open the thing. Holy crap. Uh, there's some food here that I don't really need. What is this? Hazmat gloves? No. Scrap whatever that is. Just keep eating. A hazmat jacket? Let's take it to sell it, I guess. Yeah, I don't really care about the food. Okay. We're done here? I think. Thank you, Mo Power. You served me well. Where is the traitor? Ah, yes, of course. So, what we did is we kind of funneled all the enemies into a hallway, giving them no other obstacles to fight with. We gave them a clean path to get to us, right? That was the idea. That's a really great way to get your murder on. Another thing to take into consideration is we can we could fortify that even further with more turrets. Uh, oh, right. Damn it. We could fortify that up with, like, turrets. Like, permanent good turrets. Like a power plant to generate energy and everything and just really go ham on the whole situation, right? Day one always feels so weird after a day seven. Oops. Completely missed the stairs. Uh, yeah, it feels good. Like, we made it. Game's only gonna get harder, you know? Uh, I would like this 9mm ammo. And I'd like this iron crossbow to sell back to you. No, this claw hammer. Oh, Joel, you and I are gonna have a beautiful relationship. I'm keeping the military fiber because that's fairly rare that we've come across it. I'll keep the pistol parts. I'll keep the switch. I would like a switch. Uh, just give me all, all the stuff. We have a lot of stuff to do. And a lot of stuff to work on. Hi. Uh, all that. Yep. I don't need, don't need, I don't need five of those or however many of those I have. Sell, 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 sell. Y'all come back now. Oh, I'm going to be coming back quite a few more times, big guy. I don't need headlights, I don't need the bat, I don't need the knife. Uh, I don't need any of these friggin' parts. I don't need oil, I already have a full stack of oil. Uh, I have enough ranged mods. I don't think I care about that. You can have this beer I super don't want. You can have this coffee I super don't want. An egg? Take the egg. Peace be with you. Yeah, a word not still we're still not done. Please don't leave me in here too long. I I won't. You silly? You silly Billy? Uh... Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, thank you. And you're restocked on day 31. Anyway, cool. You be careful out there. Oh, you be careful as well. I hear it's hell on day 7. Wink. Like I'm trying to be secretive. Oh, uh, hey, I do have one more item. This. Boop. Do not want. Do 0% want. Can you take five of these? Cool, thanks. <laughs> Thank you, Survivor. Check back soon. I get new merchandise daily. You get new merchandise on the 31st. Oh, holy craps. All right. What do we think of this for a base layout, yeah? 
Uh, it would be like this, actually. Seems comfortable enough. Enough room for the electronics. Enough room for everything. I think this is what I want. Uh, I have so much ammunition. Uh, we're gonna take all the 9 mil. And we're gonna move it upstairs. Uh, secured chest. Did I not make it? I have so much junk in here, I can't tell. I'm gonna put it right above. Now, is it e Can I still come out easily? Yeah, fine. No problem. Okay. Does this solve problems? Not really, but it cleans up my inventory a mess. Okay, that's a ton of 762. I got a bunch more magnum ammo I didn't really ask for for Christmas. Woof, man. Woof. That needs to go away. Uh, we already had a bunch of relays, but that's fine. Um, this switch can scram for a minute. I need all the cobblestone and all this. You can have the fuel for now. You can have that for now. Oh, I think I was trying to sell that, but I got two more anyway. Or I was trying to use it, but I got more anyway out of the whole conflict. Um, uh, yes, this goes away. Clear? We're good? All right. <laughs> Hammer time. Boop, boop. I'm happy with this pillboxian style. We'll put a door here. And what I, the only real test I want before I start placing a bunch of turrets is how to handle the placement of the turrets specifically. Um, I think we'll be okay with our current setup. It might need a little tweaking, but I think we'll be all right. So all the batteries. Oh, uh, I have some military fiber on me. Boop. Can I get that solar panel? Awesome. So, is this going to generate a lot of energy? No, it's solar power. There's going to be some inefficiencies about it. The thing to note, it's free energy, right? It's free stuff. Did I... Where's the rest of my frames? Did I eat the rest of my frames? Nope. Nope. No... No idea. Alright. I like having a bunch of those just on hand all the time. Okay, let's get cracking. So, here's how this works. We put in the solar, we turn it on. 25 watts. We are consuming 1 watt because of the relay. So in here... I'm going to chuck us in. Let's just chuck in the level 4 one that's damaged or whatever. I'm going to turn this on. And very slowly, this will start to recharge. Now, how can you tell if it doesn't have a battery power number here? The price. The price is determinant not only on the quality of the battery level, but also how much juice is in it. So we'll just give it like 15 seconds here. I'll click it again. We'll see the number change. Yeah, okay, oh, I think it kind of refreshed without me clicking it. Yeah, there it is. Nice. Huh. That gave me a cute excuse to check my work email. Um, so, cool. It's charging on its own. I like to support, or I like to set these up by sending order. Uh, like that. Or descending, I guess. Whatever. So that turns on and it'll passively generate energy for us. Now, I want to build the foundation so that way we don't lose anything. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go full bore. 
Uh, we're gonna do this. That doesn't actually connect, which is fine. Just for now, let's get these out of the way. Now I'm going to leave our the bottom ones untouched. This little bottom part, I'm going to be, I'm not touching it. So I, if I need to remove it or change it or alter it, we can do that very easily. We're not stuck. We're not stuck at all in what's going on here. So I would like this connected. So we're bringing a lot of elements from our minimalistic base into this as well. More specifically, we're trying to go very simple. I'm not stealing a huge footprint. <clears throat> we're not doing a lot of farming. We're not doing a lot of stuff. What we are doing though is trying to assert a very small amount of territory and it's ours forever. Like it, we're bunkered in, nuts tall y'all, this is my base kind of a thing, right? Um, I actually don't know how the rules for farming work. If you could do farming underground. Would be cool if you could. Oh. There's our zombie test. Hold on. Uh, hi. Oh, I don't have you plugged in or anything. I want to test the height of the turrets real quick. Uh, I would like a wire tool up here. And some of the wire crap, I think. Uh, this one. Bing, bing, bing. Oh, bing. I almost forgot the switch. Almost forgot the switch. There we go. Okay, so get out. Shut that. This connects to this. Nope. Good. Damn it. Madam, if you'd be so kind as to wait... Okay. So let's try that again. Oh no, it's the attack of the nurses? What's going on here? Yeah, come on, come on. Come on, sweeties. Let's have a chat. How's this gonna work? I think the turret gets clipped on its own hubris or whatever. energy oh my god you went through 31 bullets with that why are the junk turrets so much more potent and for example the junk turret i think i could do this and that works perfectly because it's a lot shorter are there like half hold on are there like half frames how do i do this again shape i want a a pole plate is that what i want uh, almost. On a half stack cube. No, I don't need, I don't need anything super duper fancy. Just something, a half, a half a deal. Cube, one half, round, okay. Uh, that kind of does what I want, but that's not really what I want. Full plate center T. Looking for a half a. And then I think that cures my turret height problem. Baseboard, one half. 
Uh, assuming I can actually put the turret on a half square. That's none of this is what I want. Square. Why is it all called cube? Okay. Uh, I'm hoping this works. I have no idea if this is gonna work. Aw, oh, man, it super duper doesn't. Oh, wait, this works? Just cram it, cram it in there? That's all I needed to do? Oh, well, I feel dumb now. So we do something like that and the same on the other side. I mean, all right. Must power this component for the camera to function. Well, I mean, you're showing me a preview. That gives me a very firm understanding that the camera's working, but whatever. Eh. You know what? I look like Dr. Steel a little bit. I mean... I mean, that works for me, I think. I guess? I don't know. I don't have the slightest idea. So the real deal is uh, we produce how much energy? Was it 25 energy? Oh, can this? No, no, no. Put this, put this back. Oh, when I was, when I read cube, I was reading that as like a cylinder. Ha. Huh. Okay. You produce how much? 25 watts of energy. We're consuming 16 watts of energy. The remainder is powering the batteries. The idea behind this is... Hello? Oh, come here, please. The idea behind this is... I don't need the solar... P Where the hell are you going? Hey. Huh. Um, the idea is I don't need the solar plant... Uh, the solar power to be enough to last and charge every single item. That's what the batteries are for, right? We spend all day outside the base. The batteries have all day to just trickle charge real slow-like, get all their stuff together, and then at night is when we draw the power, right? We're not producing any, but hopefully we have enough good batteries to last us the whole time. So, all right, yeah, ammo's locked. Uh, I forgot, what do these mean? Target self, why? Target allies, why? Target strangers, target zombies. Yep, perfect. Uh, legit. Straight up. So the only zombies that can really get through a one square high thing are the crawlers. Actually, I take that back immediately. Day one, I think we saw zombies crawling, and we've seen zombies crawling ever since. So that's a farce. That's a doodly farce. I just want to get this all upgraded to at least level 2. Alright. Now I might get a paintbrush, paint up the place, make it look a little retro-fied, yeah? Retro-ificated. This quarter one kind of melds all the pieces together. Alright. Oh, um, yep. The base is small? Absolutely. Will it work? I think for our needs. Heck yeah. Wasn't aiming for anything super crazy anyhow. Uh, yes, now I would like the roof patched. Since these connect to the roof, and the roof is kind of free-floating. That was hard to say, actually. Since the roof is somewhat free-floating, aside from these pieces... 
Uh, we'll get these knocked out, and then we'll do the roof. Kind of wish I bought that nail gun, but... I kind of figure after this is done... The majority of any construction work we wanted to do the base is going to be pretty, pretty finalized anyhow. Also, let's talk about the rest of the season, yeah? Um, I like to play about 30 days. For a season. For, like, YouTube and what have you. Um... The beginning parts of the game are my favorite. When resources are low and you've got to really figure out where the next food is coming from. Everything is really tight. Your budget, your maneuverability, any real... Any real things you could do to change any part of your real situation takes a little bit of patience. Probably a lot of grit as well. So to say that all, the beginning part of the game is really my favorite. I've played characters that are in the... Uh, what was my highest? Like 87? 70-something? Like, I've played characters that long. That's not, like, new territory to me. But it's not really a part of the game I really enjoy too much. Once you get the two auto turrets and a regular base and stuff, and you get things formed out, you kind of see a lot of what happened with the last seven day. Or, I guess, just this morning. We were able to do an obscene amount of damage with very little risk. We haven't even talked about traps, like spike traps, or blade traps, or electro traps. We haven't touched any of that stuff. And we were still able to put up a pretty respectable defense, I feel. We're just going to do this. Get this done with. So now that I kind of feel like our base has reached a full maturity level, I don't know really where else to go in the game. Um, we could go on bigger and bigger POI quests. We could do even more scavenging. We can level up the other traders and what have you. Um, that being said, I still have enough money for probably three more SMG turrets. That would cover us one SMG turret on every side, which would be perfect. And I think... Oh, two more pieces. Uh, I do need a vault door. That would be cool. Can I make a vault door? I forgot if that's something I could just make or buy. Uh, I also don't have any iron, but that's okay. Vault. Vault door. Oh, steel spring mech parts. Okay. Uh, steel. Oh, hello. Steel spring mech parts. Boop. That can cook all that it can cook. Boop, boop. There's that. Um, this can go away. Oh, we were very close to running out of concrete. Uh, we can always fill this whole area with whatever we want. We've got, we've got way more room for storage now. Even though I really wanted to keep it at like four storage boxes. Which I think we've accomplished our micro base. I really think we've, we've knocked it out. Uh, oh, that goes in the chest. This goes in that chest. Uh, so, oh, so what am I trying to say? Let's just finish up this kind of chit-chat here. Uh, what I'm saying is I think I'd like to keep it at 30 days. 30 days is the maximum amount of fun for me. And we get through the ma a majority of the mechanics of the game, right? We're level 47 now. I think we're well past the early game. I think we're well into the mid game or we're close to late game, depending on how you want to see it. I know there's more tougher zombies to be had, but I'm very confident with the right mods and the right tools and the right everything, we could we could handle that fairly well. Um, this isn't day seven proof because I also don't intend it to be. This is just a temporary, hey, I'm going to hang out for the night. I have some stuff to do. So... Okay, bullcrap. How was I able to put this turret here a minute ago? 
Uh, was it like this? Okay. Okay, now I'm curious. Hold on. Okay. We're fine. <laughs> I was really concerned now that it's like, oh, I gotta do some more rotating. The game was like, you know what, I'm not gonna let you put that there again. How about that? How about you think about that? Jerk. <laughs> that would make me so sad. Alright, here's some ammo. Thanks. So, the other thing is, I don't really want these turrets to go on all the time. There's no point to have this thing running 24-7. So we would also add, somewhere around here is probably a switch. How do I want to do this so it looks kind of good? From the battery bank to... Can I just... Yeah, just grab that. Uh, how about right there? Now the battery bank is getting 100% of the power. None of it's being transferred over to the turret. Oh, that's not what I wanted, but that's okay. So, can this do more than one thing? Probably not. What do I mean by that? So, I want to connect this. Hello? Oh, okay, cool. It can do multiple things. So... The switch is on, so that means this, like that. The switch is on, which means it's not receiving any power, right? If I switch it off, which you can see it's green, it is now receiving power. So if I'm going to leave for the day, we just flick it a switch. We could, we could dress this up a lot better, can make it look a lot more sexy sexy, but for right now I think it works. Oh, hello. Can I offer you some... Ah, it doesn't matter, you're dead. <laughs> yeah, deal with that. Okay, I believe electric... Or these relays can only have three connection points. So, there's that. One is going to come here for a turret there. One there. We'll do another relay like here. This will connect to whatever turrets I want there. Something like that. I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect, right? Now, the other thing that this would be important to note is I am 100% exposed to long-range zombies. I hear someone else. Sir? 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 Excuse me? Sir? Yes. Can I borrow five minutes of your time for a survey? Yes. I would like to know, um, the people of Zombatopia, or Zombieland, or wherever the hell you're from, uh, do you feel that this would hurt a bunch? Turret? T Turret? What the hell? Oh, is the light, is the switch off? It is off. Neat. Uh, just hold still, please. What? 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 What happened? What? How did you die? How did you take damage? How? Okay. Yep. Sure. Uh. Alright. Yeah, okay. <laughs> no idea. And I don't care. How about that? How about that? Okay. Um. So that's the base, right? I'll take my this. Thank you. For whatever reason, I remember vault doors either being the best or very good. And I don't have to lock it. Zombies can't dink with doors. It's wonky, but it'll do, right? Um, we could put jail doors, the, the iron jail doors on that. 
uh, if we want to add a little bit more support. But also, we can probably start brokering down with iron and doing spike traps. We can make this as big or as small as we ever want it to be. Realistically, I want to keep it small. That's really all I got. We're good on battery power. We can shoot out 223 watts per second, per, per whatever. Um, a watt is, I think, one joule over a second anyway. So that's probably an easy way to think of that. Um, the bigger the batteries we have, obviously, the better. The more capacity we'd get and all that. Um, all right, I'm kind of done fudging around with the base. Let's go talk to Mr. Joel, see what he's got for us. Did I... I have my drone on me? I do. Cool. Neat. Uh, the drone has taken very minor damage. I'll just repair you real quick. Cool. That was easy. Hi. Job me. Job me. Uh, clear Zeds. Downtown Filler 31. Sounds hot. Let's do it. Uh, so yeah, let's, I guess, let's, I keep interrupting myself. Holy crap. We're near the end of the season. It makes me excited because I've had a delightful time playing the game. It also makes me a little sad because, like, like I said, I'm kind of reaching the end of the part where, um... I kind of want to restart. I wouldn't mind trying a melee build. And that's my that's the rule. Why did the screen twitch like that? That was weird. Uh, melee only. That's it. No guns, no nothing. So heavy fortitude, heavy everything else. That would work out a lot better if I had some teammates to do like food preparation or literally any amount of science. But that's okay. Um, I actually wouldn't mind trying to do a season in a winter biome. Uh, or some other biome that isn't just a temperate zone. Wow, that's a nice church plot. Wow. I've already done this one. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. It isn't that bad. This is going to be full of jerks. To which we're going to preemptively unjerkify the room. We're going to offset our turrets like this, as usual. That way, if a zombie comes out and runs this way, and I have both the turrets here, both the turrets aren't just shooting one Zed. There's a lot of zombies dicking around. Oh, please tell me all this refreshed. Oh, sweet genius. Gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme. I'm just gonna reset the room in like 30 seconds anyway. Oh, hello, sir. Oops, missed. Yeah. What is this? Oh, clear. Ah, lame. That's okay. Um, I have no feelings about any of these things. I don't need cement, thanks. I'm absolutely done building the base. So there's that. So if I make enough ruckus... Ow. If I make enough ruckus, will the enemies just come out and break this for me? And now we let the zombies do the work. Boy, howdy. Smells like it to me. I hear somebody, though.
Clear? Clear. Oh, you know what? It's been a while since I had myself a mega crush. Mega crushing your enemies. Eat this. Uh, yeah, let's raid the room. yet. What's with all the cement? Nope. Come on, this is still taking forever. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. I was almost out of fuel. Uh, I'll learn hobo stew, sure. Okay. So, once again, um, I'm doing this reverse order, but I don't want to. So, I feel I've cleared the room. We kicked down the door. We raided the... We raided the... Looted the room, whatever. Uh, now we're going to do it the right way. Or the way in which it was intended to be done. Uh... I don't really think I want to search all this crap, do I? I'll take a lockpick. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna motor. Yep, and that leads to that. I thought there were some jerks that fell out of the sky. Yep. Magical floating man. Magical dead ass floating man. You're encumbered. Yeah, but at least I'm not dead. Uh, I'll hang on to coal. Why not? Uh, I haven't been picking it up. Haven't needed it. We would need it for gunpowder, but, eh. I just made another storage area, so I've got the space. I thought I just saw a laser that looked like... A junk turret. I guess not. Oh uh, yeah, take all the stuff. Thought I heard that jerk just say batons were stupid. Huh? You're gonna get a face full of baton, my friend. You're gonna see how stupid they are when you're dead. When you're dead. That's it. I thought I had a song. I didn't. Uh, yep, cool. Oh, okay. I keep <laughs> keep forgetting what the hell I'm talking about. So I think day 30 is going to be a good stopping point for this season. It's kind of been where I've been doing it for every other season, I feel. 30s, like I, I keep interrupting myself. I don't know if I ever finished the conversation. But like I said, or like I'm about to say, 30 days gives a new player a really good taste of what the game is like. 
Uh, maximizes the amount of fun I have with the game. And then that's that's kind of it. There's not really like a whole lot of secret agenda to it. Um, if people were like, hey, we want more specifically of this series, could you play more? Yeah, I'll have the save. I can play more. It's not that big of a deal. But for me personally, um, I'd rather play more on the multiplayer server that I have. Uh, Mega Cycle Entertainment, we've got... Here, promo time, right? Uh, I've got a Discord server. I've got a website. I host game servers for folks for free. We have a good time. We have a really tight-knit community. It's awesome. You want? You're looking for friends? Join in. Two out of the ceiling, one out of the ceiling, one out of the ceiling. Uh, you're always welcome to join. It's open to the public and everybody. Yeah. We have fun. We have good times. So that all being said, I'd rather play a bit more on that. But I wanted to do a single player session myself. That way it's just me and the game. There's not, not a lot in the way. There's going to be a dude behind here. Right in the nuts. <laughs> right in the jingle jangles. Not interested. Um, up? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pile of books no one cares about. Okay. This is where I stopped before. Oh, a red duster. That's hot. Um, I think I just need to keep going up. I think that's the indicator that yes. No. Oh, crap. I have three skill points? I must have leveled up like a freaking boss during the raids. Or during day seven. Was not paying attention. Will admit, was not paying attention. Okay, so I think this is the actual way we're supposed to go. That looks painful. Freaking brained one shot. I grade one hundred percent organic. Individually packaged is something it says on the other side as well, so it must be some sort of foodstuffs. Yeah? Oh. And there's someone behind here. Yep. I got one of them remembering top memories that remembers all the memory. Okay, you know what? You're getting a shotgun shell to the crotch. <laughs> I'm tired of having this conversation. <laughs> yep. Vetoed. Bam. Get out of here. Uh, I think I never get back there. Is that the deal? I don't think I've ever gotten back there or something. I don't really care. Mama said knock you out. Uh, most if not all of this, I would actually prefer to keep. So, Droney, my lad. Incoming Great to see you, conflict. Powering up. All systems go. Much of this stuff is not going to duplicate easily. Meaning I'm not going to find multiple copies of these items. Uh, repair that, please. Go there. That can go there. That is not going to duplicate like ever. Cool. Alright, stay with me, bro. I don't need drink. Alright, still to my death? Still to my death. Okay. We go down. 
Now this was the hallway that was just loaded with guys last time, right? Yeah, this absolutely thoroughly was. There we go. Well, the first time we cleared this, I could have sworn it was like eight zombies or seven zombies. It was more than two. But also it might have been past uh, 10 o'clock, which it's about to be now. So, guns out, buns out. Scrapple do, and eat it too. Master, we are not alone. Yeah, I got that feeling too. I got that feeling too, little beep boop. Holy crap! That was jarring on a few levels. Ooh, ratchet! A ratchet, uh... Schematic my job. We good? We clear? Alright. Office cha. That's crap. I hate ladders. I hate ladders. 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 Bitter patters. I hate ladders. Good chat. So then this goes back downstairs, and that should clear it, just about. <laughs> well, I wonder where the zombie is. Hi. Are you serious? Huh. Excellent sauce. The problem is the trader would have just closed. So we're going to have a little bit of our own time to just do whatever the heck we want. Uh, drone, yes. Hello. If you could... Actually, most of this crap I have is fairly stackable. Those baton pieces are going to be hard to find duplicates of, for sure. Uh, ba 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 Okay, we're good. Do I got my motorcycle on me? Hell yeah, I do. Vroom vroom. Uh, knaves gain green creamery. I don't know if that means creamery, like turning milk into cream, or turning um, uh, you know, the other one, a funeral thing. Is this the church? What the hell is this? This is a nice building. Probably would be an absolute pain in the rumpus to clear, but it looks like a nice thing. Oh no, I know what this is. Yeah, this is... <laughs> this is the pharmaceutical joint, which I'm not gonna go into. I'm not scared of it, it's just there's nothing... I'm fine with it. I'm fine, we got more than half, I'm fine. There's so many mutated things, I was... This is such a fight. How do we get into this parking structure? No, seriously. How okay, here we go. Uh, I'm used to the old parking structures having a lot more cars in them. Well, I got nothing to do for a while, so let's just work it from the bottom up. I like the flooded look. Okay, I hear somebody. I've got a bad feeling about this. I don't. They always run in a straight line. Yep, they mostly, when they get their beads on you, they'll serpentine a bit, but then once you get them in a straight line, 
pull the trigger. Have a little fun. We are gonna walk away with a lot of parts. Yeah, I don't mind just gunning my way through this. I'm encumbered. Breaking cucumbered. Uh, that's worth leather. I'm sure I'm going to have leather anyway. So see how everything's still moving at pretty relatively full speed? Huh. Okay, I'll take more uh, robotic parts. Heck yeah. Um, I can't deploy this, can I? Technically, I can. Master, we are not alone. Trust me, I get that feeling. Uh, also, whenever I... <laughs> I think you know what I said before, water has some pretty interesting properties All in this game. Go. How may I help? Um, this car is floating on top of water, which is cute. I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want that. Thanks. And then when I hit it, it re-remembers, oh wait, this isn't the ground. Ooh, another level six. Nice. Real nice. Real nice. Yep, and now there's no water here. See? It's really it's really weird. How it works. I'm actually gonna keep the rods and the springs so I can make more iron back home. Oh good luck with that. Once you have a gun, have up the nighttime scaries ain't nearly as scary as they were. Door is locked. Can't blame them for trying. Can't blame them for trying. Hi. Do you remember me? What? Blah, strong bad, blah. There's no way to get into this room without doing a little forceful entry. Unless there's a way to fall from the top, which I don't know. But effectively, we're just going to dink around here until it's morning time. We can take in the trade. Trade in the trade. Oh, okay. That's how we were supposed to get up here. That makes sense. Sure, take that. Just bounce my way over here. Scrap. Don't need hops. I think I have a lockpick. Anyway, I'm going to call this an episode here pretty quick once I fail this lockpicking check. Yep. All right. Fair enough. Yeah, let's call this an episode. Thank you all for joining me. Name is John Megacycle, and I hope to catch you next time for more Seven Days to Die. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and game with my crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.